Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Uh, I'm going to run over a quick overview of a game called Epic War. Um, it's going to go through the troops and how to keep them alive as most people are coming off of new protection. The three day protection's up for most of them. And so here is one to help you keep your troops safe. So first of all, you need armies training so you have your ranged your riders and your short distance as well as your siege um, you can see the little uh, battle triangle here so the infantry over the ranged and ranged over the cavalry and that's basically how the power triangle goes uh, siege are kind of independent um, weak against them all and then you have the wall which is weak against the siege units obviously wouldn't make sense if it wasn't that way so you have your training your healing uh, currently i have thirty nine thousand hospital beds and um, i have my hero my main hero here with one soldier um, sheltered in the hidden outpost. The reason I do that is if that you get attacked and that hero gets captured, you lose all of your technology bonuses and other um, buffs, which can be a real bummer. And we'll go into that in a different video. Uh, but right now, so basically you have two main ways. You can shelter your troops. Um, my maximum outpost holds 45,900. So currently, that'll hold all of my troops. Uh, and that number goes up as you upgrade your castle. Um, the other way to do that with your overflow, actually, I like to do this first when I have more, is uh, scroll over to find a barbarian. Uh, or an inactive will work. Uh, basically, you just pick a guy, set a rally. Uh, okay, so he's not in alliance, an alliance, so I can't rally him. Okay, so you pick a guy, you set a rally, do an eight hour rally. And you select all of your troops so I can hold 43,000 in my troops. So that gives me plenty of space and I can do two rallies. So that would uh, give me, you know, an extra 86,000 troop uh, capacity for storing them. Which is very nice. Uh, let's take a look at a battle here because this is pretty important so let's see here oh, did I delete it let's see okay so here is a battle no that's me farming him Sorry about that. Okay, here we go. So here's the battle. I attacked. I had 16,000. Uh, he had 4,200 defenders. All of his guys were injured. Zero were killed. And 301 survived and had to go to the hospital. Uh, that's where your hospital capacity comes into play. Uh, because if you don't have enough hospital beds, all your injured troops will die. And that's no fun. So you want to make sure you have enough hospital beds for all your troops, especially when defending, because all of your troops uh, will end up injured instead of dead. The attacking army, however, um, does take casualties uh, dead. And that's the primary way uh, 
troops will die is if you don't have enough hospital space and attacking. Those are the, in fact, those are the only ways they will die. So make sure you have enough hospital beds for your troops, shelter them, send them on rallies, keep them safe when you're away. If you cancel a rally, you get your troops back right away. So it uh, doesn't hurt you any to send that. Um, again, you don't have to select a player, just select a barbarian uh, village. Um, and this hit here, I just hit this guy because he had plenty of resources to take. And I need them. So I wanted them. Hope this video helped you learn how to shelter and keep your troops safe. Uh, hit that like and subscribe button. Also that bell icon as I will be uploading more videos um about this uh, epic war and hopefully uh you enjoy it thanks